Hello everyone, how's it going? My name is Sassy, and today I'll be showing you how to beat the Easter Egg in the Black Ops 3 Custom Zombies map Super Mario 64 Lumps Fortress. I stream Custom Zombies on Wednesdays, so subscribe if you're interested. And now without further ado, here we go! This map only has a really small Easter Egg, which will award you with the Ray Gun Ultra, and pack-a-punching this Ray Gun will turn it into a gold Ray Gun. The first thing you'll need to do is obtain the Storm PSR Sniper from the Mystery Box. You'll then need to pack punch the sniper. To get to pack punch, link the two green pipes. The first link is on top of the floating platforms. To get there, you'll need to open up the jump pad to the tower. You'll first need to open up the area with Speed Cola down the ramp. Then go to the sign with the fire on it to the right of Speed Cola and by the door. This sign opens up the area to Mule Kick and Jug. Then find the sign with fire above it not far from Jug and by the door. This sign opens up the jump pad found right by Deadshot. Take the jump pad to the top and pay the Goomba to go onto the floating platforms. Then link the first part of the teleporter. The second link is backed by Quick Revive. Once you have the teleporter linked, head back to the pipe on the floating platform and take it to teleport to Pack a Punch. Then Pack a Punch the Sniper. You will now need to shoot the seven stars around the map with the Pack Sniper. There is one star next to Pack a Punch. There is one star floating in the air by Quick Revive. There is one to the right of Double Tap. There is one on the cut wall near Electric Cherry. There is one on the pole at Mule Kick. There is one on top of the tower above where Flopper is. For this one, I had to try to shoot it while using the jump pad. And there is one in the floating cage. Once you've shot all seven stars, the secret panel next to Widow's Wine will open up. You can now buy the Ray Gun Ultra for 10,000 points. Pack punching this gun will give you the golden Ray Gun. If you need some extra points, you can shoot or knife the coins around the map. The yellow coins will give you 100 points, the red coins will give you 200 points, and the blue coins will give you 500 points. There are 8 red coins around the map, and shooting them all will play this sound. Other than that, I'm not really sure what else getting the red coins do. One is above the barrier on the ramp by Quick Revive. One is right near the power switch and double tap. One is underneath the blue rock guy barrier near Vulture's Aid. There are three in the area with Electric Cherry. And there are two on the floating platforms. And I have been able to find seven blue coins around the map. There are two underneath the map. One is underneath where the two mini ramps are that will lead you to Crusader's Ale. And one is underneath the Deadshot platform. One is behind the colored blocks to the right of Crusader's Ale. There is one behind Double Tap. One is behind Jug. One is in the water by the blue blocks. And one is on top of the tower where the star is. You can get this one by throwing a grenade up there. As far as I know, and according to JD Colbrew himself, getting all the blue coins don't do anything. And that's it! I'll be doing more easter egg guides in the future, so subscribe if you're interested, leave me a comment if you have any questions, and don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.